Hi, uh, welcome. My name is Marcia Smirka. I'm a six star elite coach with Beachbody. And um, I just wanted to first of all welcome you here. Um, chances are you are watching this video because you are interested and curious about what we do as online coaches. Or um, maybe your, cur your current coach invited you to join our group and thought you might be a good fit for this. So, either way, I wanted to welcome you and just share with you a little bit about my story and why I decided to coach. Um, just in case you know the my story relates with you and your situation so um two years ago i was a stay-at-home mom i have four kids um they're all um, under the age of nine so right now they are um three six eight and nine um, when i started coaching they were you know two years younger so um i had a baby at the time and my oldest was seven and um Basically, when we started having kids, when we had our first um, child, we made the decision for me to leave my career so that we could, um, that I could be a stay-at-home mom and raise our family. So um, it was not easy. We made a lot of sacrifices. Um, you know, everything from cutting out our garbage service to you no know, cell phones. Um, basically, anything and everything that we could, we looked at our budget and our expenses and anything that was not a necessity we cut out um, to be able to make it work so we were living on one income my husband was the sole provider for our family um, for seven years and we literally had no savings we had to cash out my retirement um, just to be able to pay the bills um, every month i was in charge of the bills and we had gotten a lot of money fights um, every month i would have to stack the, our bills and decide which ones we would be able to pay that month and which ones would have to wait until the following month. Um, it was really, really hard. Uh, the other thing that I did, we moved and live out in the country and um, we have two huge, huge gardens. So my job was to grow our food in our garden and do all the food preservation. So I dehydrated, I canned, I froze. Um, my husband hunts deer, so we had venison made into meat and had that processed. My parents are dairy farmers, so we got our hamburger from them. Um, gosh, what else did we do? Two years ago, it, it doesn't seem like very long ago, but it, it really was, you know, in terms of how our lives have changed. Um, like I said, no garbage service. We burn our garbage, or my husband would load it up in his truck, the diapers. He would take them to work. And bless his soul, driving an hour a day <laughs> one way with stinky, dirty diapers. I don't know if he did that for, you know, that long. Um, what else? I don't know. So whatever we were able to do to, to cut corners, we did. And it still wasn't enough. Um, my husband was driving two hours a day to work back and forth. Um, I really felt like a single parent. Um, he had a pretty good job, but it was a lot of hours. He worked overtime consistently every single week. Um, he was never home for dinner, rarely home to tuck the kids in for bed. And every night the kids would ask me if they were going to see their dad. And I had to tell them no, that he wasn't going to be home that night. So it was just not the life that we had wanted for our family. Um, anyway, so when uh, we knew we were done having kids, Marin was, like I said, a little over one at the time. Um, I was, you know, talking with Adam, my husband, one night and I recognized that he was already doing what he could to support our family that I had to chip in. Um, I had to help contribute uh, financially in whatever way I could. I did take up crocheting during that time and I thought, well, maybe I can, you know, sell some of my crochet work at holiday fairs or whatever, but it just, it wouldn't have been enough. Um, I really needed an income. So I thought about going back to school. My degree is in psychology. I have a minor in art. Um, but I really didn't want to um, go back to the career path that I had chosen before. Um, I was working with people with developmental disabilities, which I really, really loved. Um, but it was just a really high stress job, um, high management. I was um, supervising other employees and staff and doing a lot of the hiring and training and firing. And I just didn't want that responsibility. I, I really didn't want to have to work for somebody. Um, so little did I know that there was such a thing called an online health coach. And funny that I actually went on and like Googled online health coaching. It didn't lead me to Beachbody. And it, it just it seemed, and maybe it did, and maybe I just wasn't open to it at the time. I don't know. But um, I wasn't on any social media whatsoever. Um, my husband was. He was on Facebook. And he let me know that one of his friends um, was talking about online health coaching and that 
I should get in touch with her and talk with her about it. So I um, gave her a phone call, I called her, and because I wasn't on Facebook, and we talked about it a few times, probably two or three times. Um, I was entirely skeptical. It sounded way too good to be true. Um, I didn't believe her. So I went back and I Googled and I YouTubed and I tried to find out as much as I could about it to see if it was real. And um, basically what it boiled down to was that my husband knew her and trusted her and he saw her succeeding with the business. And I had to ask myself, why not me? If other people are doing this and being successful, is there any reason that I couldn't do it too? Um, and I also knew that I was backed up against a wall. Um, I didn't you know, want to work a traditional job. I didn't have the flexibility or freedom to do that because I was raising our family um, and didn't want to be putting our kids into daycare. So I basically decided from the start that once I did my coaching enrollment that I was going to go all in. And I never looked back. Um, I knew in my heart that I was meant for something greater and that I had something wonderful to contribute and that I could help make a difference, even if it was one, one person to help. I had no idea um, what kind of capacity uh, I would be able to help other people, but I knew that I could help at least one person or at least three people. And once I got started and recognized um, how great of an impact I truly was making, it just you know, the, the ripple effect started happening and I just kept getting um, referrals from current happy customers. And then, you know, my customers wanted to join my team as a coach and it just kind of created a domino effect from there. So um, my purpose for being brought to Beachbody was the business. Um, a lot of other people might um, have started in a challenge group or an accountability group and started with the workouts. Um, my story is a little different. I um, was brought to Beachbody for the business. So for that reason, I just really, truly am so passionate about um, sharing the awareness and creating awareness among other moms, especially um, moms like me who need more income um, but feel trapped um, being at home or they want to be home with their kids. Um, that's not anything that I would give up. Um, even looking back, it was hard and it was a financial strain and burden on our family, but um, you know, to be able to be home and present for my kids' firsts and the experiences that I had and the, the flexibility now that I have with coaching and earning income while still being present for my kids is just truly a dream come true and um, it's a blessing and a gift. So thank you for listening to this. Um, I'm really excited to share with you um, the other information that I know you're, you're wanting to hear. So if at any time you have questions, just drop you know, drop that in the comment below and we will get back to you. All right. Thank you for listening. Bye.